second exercise we'll be doing uh, takeoff from Adira Airport and we'll have engine detach first engine one then engine two after that and because we won't have enough altitude and time to return to the runway I will be ditching all water um, let's see how it goes so first take off everything is set parking brake off and take off power set and we monitor the engines take off power is set and we're accelerating Knots. And D1 will be positive rate of climb, then gear up. Gear is going up. And flaps 1, throttles to climb. Okay, speed two one zero set. And flaps up. And we lost one engine. And we lost this physically and engine number two also emergency power is now on and we turn on the EPU immediately and ram here and we try not to stall 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 speed at 150 or above and for ditching we'll again lose all power because the APU will turn off when we push the ditching sign because all outlet valves and in inlet valves into the aircraft will be closed to make it float above the water You will turn off. Five hundred. So crew brace for impact. Four hundred. Three hundred. Two 
600. One hundred, fifty, forty, thirty, twenty, retard, retard, eleven degrees, retard, 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 and we touch the water. So although the simulator doesn't simulate the swimming and sinking of the airplane, it's not built for that, but uh, those are the main procedures uh, to ditch. And uh, what you saw was uh, both engines separating from the airplane and then what has to be done to successfully land on, on water. <laughs> Right above Madeira, flight level 200, and the fuel just disappeared. So we have zero fuel, and that means that engines are now off with no possibility to turn them on. We know that we are 12 miles from Madeira, so we're descending. And the difference from the last exercise is that because there's no fuel, we can't turn on the APU. Uh, we can only use the ram device, the small propeller that descends from the airplane's belly and spins in the wind and generates a small amount of power. Right, thrust levers idle. No relight will be available. And we just send to at least flight level 150 to deploy the RAM device. So we keep descending. We're currently on the emergency power. And it's just enough for the main controls of the airplane and main three monitors to work. Right, my dear, on the right side. but way below us So we are at level 120, 12,000 feet. The runway is at about 200 feet, so we have still have 12,000 feet to go. Um, it's right ahead of us, but it's too low. Uh, we'll have to turn to the right and do a circle, essentially, to lower the speed and to lower our altitude. Yeah, 
and we have the right on line nursing generator online. All right. And we turn to the right. All right, minimum arrow key speed is 140, so when we have power up to landing, that's why we have to keep it at above at 150. And generators oh. on. Nothing happens. Let's try to off. And to conserve power, IRS is two to off. Turn right again. And speed two to zero. Five thousand feet. And engine masters go off, they won't help us now. Four thousand feet from the site. Transform. Okay, the flap one is almost deployed, and speed one seven zero two thousand feet. We should have just enough to land. We only have one chance to do it. Will be left three landing and gear extension. Release the gear. We we'll did this at last moment because it will slow us down. down then we'll lock it down position set flaps three only slats will deploy flaps themselves will not deploy in this configuration so we have speed 150 that's enough and speed brakes are on and the plane is very slow to respond above the runway and then touch down and then no reverse thrust, thrust of course we use the remaining brake energy we have to 
try to stop the plane on the runway. And the red device is not spinning anymore. That means that we lost all remaining electrical power. But we're still on the ground, so we can now evacuate. So that's it for this exercise. I uh, hope you liked our dual engine failure exercises. Uh, we'll keep on going with some more next time. See you later.